Good morning, friends. Happy Thursday. Welcome to meeting. All right, the month is still May. And yesterday was the 27th, it's super hot. And today is the 28th, and it's also Kyle's birthday and Rylan's birthday. So we're gonna have to sing happy birthday to them. But first, let's count our calendar. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, high power, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight. And then tomorrow we're gonna to count to 29, 30, and 31 because when I see you on the next, on the Monday, we'll have a new calendar, it'll be June. All right, let's say happy birthday to Rylan and Kyle, ready? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Kyle and Rylan. Happy birthday to you. All right, let's do our days of the week song. Bauer, you gotta back up so that my friends can see the calendar and that they can see the, the days of the week. Ready? Bauer, go lay down. You're blocking me in the camera. All right. Days of the week. 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 There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday, and then there's Saturday, days of the week. 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 All right. So if today is the 28th, it is Thursday. And if today is Thursday, the 28th, yesterday was Wednesday. I hope everyone got outside and played yesterday because it was super hot. And if today is Thursday the 28th, tomorrow will be Friday the 29th. All right. Why don't you go check the weather outside? As you can see, it's very bright outside, but it's pretty cloudy when I took Bauer out. So I'm going to do partly cloudy, but still hot. Seems like it's still going to be in the 80s today but not as sunny as yesterday. So partly cloudy, it's still hot. All right, let's practice our letters and our numbers. And then I have a nice, I have a book for you today. Okay, ready? Repeat after me. U, up, a. Uh. V, van, z. G, game, g. Z, zebra, z. W, wind, w. A, apple, a. I, itch, i. D, dog, d. M, man, m. T, top, t. K, kite, k. Q, u, queen. Y, yellow, y. F, fun, f. X, fox, x. E, ed, e. N, nut, n. O, octopus, ah. S, snake, C, cat, k, b, bat, b, p, pan, p, l, lamp, u, h, hat, h, j, jug, j. Right. Let's do our numbers. 
Remember, we're doing the teen numbers from 11 to 20. What number? 12. 19. What number? 18. Not this one. 20. What number? 15. What number? 17. 16. 11. What number? 14. 13. That was nice and quick. All right, we're gonna read this story called Just a Special Day. I think I've read it to one other friend on our video chats, but I thought it was a really good book to share with everyone, especially since it's spring and summertime and usually we like to play baseball outside. So let's see, what do we think the book is about? So when you look at the cover, who's on it? Looks like they're at a baseball game, right? Looks like there's a little boy, he's the, usually the main character in these stories. And then maybe this is his dad. Maybe there's some friends over there that he knows. Looks like he's about to catch a ball. So maybe he gets a ball at a baseball game. Let's see. All right. Mom and little sister have to go downtown. Dad and I stay home. We have a special day, just dad and me. Mom gives us a list of chores. We'll clean the kitchen just for mom, but that isn't much fun. We ride bicycles to the park instead. Dad throws the football. I run to catch it. I say, I'm sorry. Looks like he fell into someone's picnic. I'm hungry, I say. We get hot dogs. Mine has too much mustard. My clothes are messy. Dad takes me to the water fountain to clean me off. So they got a hot dog and he spilled it all over his overalls. I have a leftover hot dog bun. I will feed the fish. I throw it in the pond. Oops, now all the fish are coming to me. The fishermen are not happy. Dad says, I have an idea. Let's go to the ballpark and watch a game. You have to let me know in the comments to tell me if you have been to a baseball game before. If it was like a special one, like the Red Sox or Spinners, or if you've just been to like a baseball game for your brother and sister, or you play baseball. The batter hit a foul ball. Up and up it went, then down, down it came. I will catch it for you, Dad says. Wow. Oh, what happened to his head? The ball must have hit it. Dad misses the catch, and now he needs a doctor. Oh, poor Dad. The doctor takes a look at Dad, and he fixes Dad up. Looks like he just needed a nice pack. We leave, and we go home. I think Dad got too excited. Dad, I say, today was fun. You just need to rest and finish your chores for Mom. Dad falls asleep, so I fill the dishwasher. I fill the washing machine, it needs lots of soap, and I fold the laundry. Oh, he's doing all his chores for his dad. While his dad rests his head. Dad, wake up. I see and see what I did to help, I say. Uh-oh. I don't think you did a very good job folding the laundry. What do you think? I ask, are you happy? Are you happy that I helped, Dad? Dad gives me a hug. I give my dad a hug, too. Hooray, I say. Mom and little sister are home. Mom says, what kind of date did you guys have? 
Do you think they'll tell him all about their day? Tell her what all about her day? I say, it was a special day, right, Dad? So it wasn't just all about this, right? They only went to the baseball game for a short amount of time, and they went to all other places, and he didn't catch the ball. He got hit right in the head with it. And then the little brother, or the little boy, he ended up ha helping his dad with all the chores around the house so his dad could get better. It's a cute story, right? All right. Meeting is all done for today, and I will see you tomorrow for May 29th.